what we're first going to do is take the nozzle out of the boot and put a rag of some sort up into the boot where the nozzle uh, spout usually is. That way it simulates the nozzle still being in the boot and you won't have any power to the nozzle. From there we're going to put a nozzle over the top of a bucket, then spout into the bucket. Make sure we drain it in any way so all the fluid that's still in the nozzle is all out of it. Then we're going to lay the nozzle atop the bucket and loosen up the, the swivel in the, from the hose, take the swivel off of the hose, and then take the swivel off of the nozzle uh, in making sure to drain the hose and the nozzle while doing so. You have to use a gasoline approved pipe red sealant so when you're putting the swivel back onto the nozzle what you want to do is put a thin layer of the pipe dope onto the swivel, male threads, uh, use the brush that comes with it to spread it out so all the threads get covered. Uh, from there you'll thread the swivel into the nozzle and uh, tighten it up uh, probably about one and a half turns past hand tight and then you'll do the same thing with the pipe thread sealant to the hose. Uh, again just use the brush that comes with it and spread it on and then from there take the hose and put it onto the swivel and again one and one and a half two turns past hand tight. You don't want to over tighten it. When installing it uh, you want to make sure that you don't cross thread any threads. I uh, want to make sure everything goes in straight. After you have it all set up and you've checked for leaks and everything's good, you go ahead and rotate the nozzle uh, in both joints. Make sure the nozzle rotates every direction it's supposed to. But you don't want to hear any rubbing or clicking or anything like that. You want it to make sure it goes nice and smooth like a swivel's supposed to. If you have any questions, can, you can call Husky. Uh, you can talk to the customer service representatives and they'll either be able to help you or put you in contact with one of us engineers and we can help solve any of your problems.